Here's something else you might not have known about storytelling, and it's going to be, I hope, a pleasant surprise for you. If you can tell an interesting story in your presentation, people will forget and forgive any other flaw you have. That's right. It sort of masks your errors. Take, for example, the top TED speaker of all time, Sir Ken Robinson, gives a brilliant speech on creativity and education, but by most standard definitions, his body language is awful. He stands there with his feet planted as if they'd been nailed to the floor. Now, I don't want to seem insensitive. Maybe he does have mobility issues, but from the so-called professional public speaking perspective, he should be moving around the stage naturally, stopping, moving for transit. He doesn't do any of that. And guess what? People love his speech. They watch it. They share it. They tell other people to watch it. It is, by every single metric, a huge, huge success. And the all-time, at this moment, most popular TED speech ever. So keep that in mind. I've also noticed that when speakers tell great stories, they can have ahs and ums come out of their mouth. No one remembers. A shirt tail can hang out. A collar can go up. No one remembers or cares. So that's the other beauty of putting great, interesting stories throughout your presentation is it covers up any other flaws you might have.